For now, former President Dr. Goodluck Jonathan is not contemplating joining the Governing All Progressive Congress APC to run on his platform as a presidential candidate, Sunday Tribune can report. National Secretary, APC Ketika and Extraordinary Convention Planning Committee, Senator John Akbanudu Dehe, had said APC would welcome Jonathan if he defected to the party as it would strengthen the ruling party. But a source close to the former president told Sunday Tribune that although some APC leaders have been wooing the ex-president, Jonathan is not thinking of joining the APC. This is just as the acting national chairman of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, Elder Yemi Akinwumi, told Sunday Tribune that the ex-president has assured them that he would not dump the PDP. He said speculations about Jonathan going to APC were laid to rest during a meeting he and others had with the former president. Investigations has, however, revealed the reason Jonathan's name is being practically dropped by the leadership of the APC. Sunday Tribune gathered that the development might not be unconnected with the schism in the ruling party over who succeeds President Muhammad Buhari amid clamor for power shift by politicians from the southern part of the country. Three groups are said to have emerged in the APC over the presidential ticket of the party. They are a group loyal to the recuperating former Lagos State Governor, Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu, a group opposed to his presidential aspiration, and the third, a group waiting to see where the pendulum would swing. Although Tinubu has not declared his presidential ambition, a group in the vanguard of the aspiration, the Southwest Agenda Swagger, has begun mobilization of opinion leaders in the zone to support the Tinubu presidential project. But it was learned that the leadership of the APC, who are referred to as Buhari's men have begun a strategy of testing the waters with the Jonathan Kite to gauge the reaction of Tinubu and his group. Many Tinubu's men, particularly those who have openly identified with the Swaga project, were said to have lost out in the power game during the two of the three legged congresses of the party. For instance, in Ekiti, the national chairman of Swaga, Senator Dayo Adeyeye, has been shouting, Blue Mother over the outcome of the World Congress in the state. The group is before the Federal High Court in the state praying for the annulment of the Congress. According to a credible source in the party, the leadership of APC has been sending a signal to the Tinubu camp with the way it has handled the two Congresses held so far, he explained. The party has been inundated with threats from some quarters that if they oppose the Tinubu project, there will be consequences. But the anti tinubu forces within the party are goading the leadership to test the waters with the Jonathan option to see if his men would start a fight within the party. The intention is to quench whatever fire that will come from the Tinubu camp before the election, the source further stated. However, another source in Jonathan's camp, while reacting to the story of the likely defection of the former president to the APC, said, I can't rule out anything. The source said the former president was bitter about the treatment meted out to him after the loss of the 2015 presidential election and decided to stay away from the PDP. The source said the PDP leadership watched while Jonathan was sidelined in the scheme of things in the party, even in his own state, Bielsa, forcing him to support the candidate of APC in the governorship election held in the state in November 2019. But the PDP national chairman who spoke to Sunday Tribune said since he came on board, he had identified some leaders of the party that were not happy with the way things were being done, including the former president, and had assured them things would change. He admitted that Jonathan had not been attending the National Executive Committee neck of the PDP and has assured them he would do so henceforth. I can assure you that you will not hear for you will not hear of any defection from the PDP again, whether at the state or national level. Since I came on board, we've been able to identify people that were not happy enough about the party, and we went to beg and pacify them. I was with former president, Dr. Goodluck Jonathan. You should have read that in the papers. For some time, he had not been attending our neck meetings. He assured me that he would henceforth be attending. This has led to rest speculations over whatever whether he's leaving 
the party. PDP remains the alternative party for Nigeria. Compare Nigeria under PDP to what is now under APC. For example, we know the value of Naira now. What is the price of Petro now? It was 87 Naira in 2015 when Dr. Goodluck Jonathan was handing over to President Mohamed Buhari in 2015. He said, we are capitalizing on the demerits of APC on what is currently happening in the nation. Banditry all around, mismanagement of economy, the sufferings of Nigerians today. Nigerians are poorer than they were in 2015. That is not an issue of campaign. Nigerians can see these things themselves. The economy of Nigeria has collapsed. The choice that Nigerians made in 2015 by voting Buhari has turned out to be a disaster, not just for Nigerians themselves, but also the economy of the country. Nigerians who voted for Buhari are regretting their actions now, including the core North, the PDP chairman said. Good luck, Jonathan's name has been in the news for some time now and all for the reason uh, that uh, there are plans for him to defect. APC is cooking something. APC is doing this and all that. Now the national chairman, uh, the acting national chairman has explained why um, APC is flying the um, Jonathan's kite. That means why Jonathan's name has been coming up of late. You know, it was um, the APC Ketika Committee Secretary who shook the media space, who shook the internet by making a remark, making a statement that um, Goodluck Jonathan will be given presidential ticket. But there was a clause to that, that if he joins the party. Uh, we know later on he amended, he adjusted the statement that uh, actually, um, if Good Goodluck Jonathan joins, then um, he's going to contest um, like every other aspirant in the party. But however, the, the acting national chairman of uh, PDB had just mentioned that um, what APC they are doing, they are just trying to to test the waters. You know, there are other big wings in the All Progressive Congress who are eyeing this 2023 presidential um, seat, the likes of uh, Tinubu, Asawaju Tinubu. He's not in the country at the moment, but we've seen the way, <laughs> it's possible that it's because of uh, the, the way Good Luck Jonathan's name has been coming up. Uh, Tinubu's home in the United Kingdom has turned to Mecca. These guys are just trooping in and out. I don't know what they are going to receive there or what is going on. But well, we know very well that it's all connected to 2023. And um, uh, it was stated that um, they, are, they are just testing the water to see how Tinubu's men, Tinubu's foot soldiers, his loyalists, his disciples, how they will take it, how they will take Jonathan's name popping up and before they can um, unleash or finally um, decide on what they will do. Well, but from good luck Jonathan's end, he has assured the PDP, he has promised them, he has vowed that uh, he's not moving. But a chieftain stated that uh, you can't rule out anything, meaning that uh, you cannot really uh, uh, conclude politics is uncertain, that anything can change. Well, guys, we'll see how all of this plays out. There's nothing hidden that will not come out. If it's going to defect at some point, we'll still find out. But the truth is that Nigerians have expressed their displeasure uh, uh, and also stating that if he dares, it, that means um, he's going to just lose the sort of respect they have for him. Well, guys, let's hear your own take. Thank you once again for staying tuned. Please don't forget to like, share, and to subscribe. So, like, come your way again with more updates. Bye.